Throughout Gary's Mod, there has been a plethora of different troll NPCs. From pack one, two, three, four, I can't remember if there's a five, to the super troll pack that was removed and then re-added again. We've had odd looking troll, even odder looking troll, and just plain f***ing weird. And of course, who could forget the giant trolls? <laughs> And there's plenty of them. Well, of course, there is another troll pack. This is the extreme troll pack. If you thought Super was pretty extreme, it's not as extreme as this pack is. And to just emphasize that even further, there's 40 of these freaks. And in this video, we're going to take a look at 20 of them while we save the other 20 for another video, just because it, it'll be way too long of a video. So come with me on Mega Construct as we delve into the new world of trolls. For this video, we're going to be using the Arctic weapons because, well, they're pretty kick-ass and look at my little tag. I mean, come on, that's pretty sick. Also, Linux, I'm sorry. The Alone House. This is the first of the trolls. Obviously, the health is ridiculous. We're not going to focus too much on that because we always do and you guys know by now that trolls have crazy health values. So we're just going to skip that and focus on the design. We have a troll with tentacles and seemingly two heads. Is this like the dichotomy one feels when you're laughing on the inside, but deep down, the darker version of you is secretly taking over? Manifesting itself as if some kind of symbiotic but also at the same time parasitic twin? No, it's just an asshole looking troll with a lot of weird extrusions. Let's see what it does when we let it loose. All right, it wiggles towards us and it smacks us with its evil twin. There's gonna be some trolls that might be a little too big for this and you're gonna also figure out that <laughs> that thing I said about Arctic weapons, um, yeah, that might not work out in this video. I mean, okay, let's give it a shot. Yep, nope, we're gonna need something bigger. I've always liked the long revolver, because the long revolver, it does damage, but not too much damage. However, as we see, the troll fades away. By the way, I'm full of shit. This is the Backrooms Roamers. What a strange name. We can see some of the classic trolls from the past coming in. We have the female troll, the other weird troll, and the Brolage Troll, all in this creepy, weird amalgamation of nastiness. I really need to extend my vocabulary. I feel like I say the same five words all over again. Anyway, we got lots of health, but for some reason he's not coming after us. Maybe he is stuck? I think, wait, is he, is he afraid? I don't know what's going on. Um, by the way, I also just navigation meshed this whole map, so it might be a little funky. However, this troll, Oh, and we have a phase two. It looks like Brolge has finally, or Brolage, how, how the f*** do you say that? It looks like he has fully manifested into the creature he was always meant to be. And this is the result of that. However, he is also stuck. Um, yeah, you know, screw this, I'm going to fly grass. I tried, okay? It, it just didn't work out. I try to do different maps to try to not do the same boring flat grass map, but it never works. However, we have a giant looking troll. What happens when he gets too close? Wait. Oh, okay. He gets there, he just takes his time. And taking him out is, I mean, he has a lot more health, but... Oh, what was that? <laughs> you guys know Brolge, right? Or Brolage? How about Barrels? Barrels? How the hell do you say that? It's like a teddy bear with the Brolage head on it. And it just tippy toes to you. Imagine being woken up at night and this comes into your room like this. I want it dead. Please get out of my nightmares. Desperation, because I am desperate at this point for always doing these troll videos on this channel. We can actually see a pretty modest looking NPC. I mean, not too much health considering the troll NPCs. And it looks to be some kind of freakish looking llama with spikes on its neck. And it walks to you sideways as if it has some kind of condition. And it kills you in one hit like all trolls do. We must kill it for science. So let's go ahead and, oh, the horns fall off and it just dies. I will say the animations look awesome. Like there's a lot more animations this time around than I remember in the other pack. So good on you, man. Dimensional death, man. That's going to be the band name I pick whenever I get around to that. What a strange looking NPC. Wait, we have sound effects. It's as if it's a siren. Anyway, this one looks to be a spider like creature which we've seen a lot. Like that seems to be a very common theme in the troll universe. And taking it out is not too bad either. Okay, you guys are gonna have to bear with me for this one. <laughs> An eyeball 
Really? A black blob with an eyeball and two legs? Also, what is... It's quick as hell. Whoa, what? Okay, how do you say that? Dorsalessness? Kind of sick name, not gonna lie. Um, anyway, he walks around with his creepy looking eyeball, trying to kill you with like a bajillion health, but not a bajillion jillion health, if you get my drift. Killing it, you can see its eye closes for the last time as it swirls into a vortex into nothingness. I'm digging this nothingness thing. Failed experiment. This looks like the surprise party ones, except, um, hella tortured. Okay, I like the little head flip thing. That's pretty neat. I think we have another fast one here. Oh, sh <laughs> yeah, yeah, we do. Holy crap, man. And he's pretty intelligent, too. He knows where you're gonna go. He kills you and then celebrates about it. What an asshole. Wait, where the hell? Are you? Oh, oh, my God. He's so quick. We can't even catch up to him. Killing him, we can see he just, well, he just, yeah, he's dead. Flesh knitter. Whoa. <laughs> okay. What the hell is this thing? I've seen a lot of troll designs, but never anything like this. This one doesn't even look like a troll. It looks like Urgot went through a grinder. And I say that in the most kindest way possible. But we can see it is a knitting looking creature if it stops having a goddamn seizure. And it freaks the heck out. Okay. By the way, that's my phone. Sorry about the notification noises. <laughs> Nighttime slaughterer. Oh, he turned the entire sky green. Now it matches my setup. Honestly, this looks really strange. Like, <laughs> we're in the heart of Chernobyl. Where, where did he go? Is this another quick one? Oh, whoa. I think we have our answer. Now, which side is he gonna come from? That's the real question. Oh, there he is. Sneaky little shit. But, uh, yeah, he dies pretty quick. I like the screen effect. I like the extravagant designs. I like the crazy effects that happen. Those are my favorite trolls. Red Woods. Oh, God. It looks like a diseased neuron. Gonna be honest, these troll NPCs are making me neurotic, so maybe this is what I'll look like in a few years. Why do they always hide under here? I guess there's nowhere else to hide, but so weird, man. Wait. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. Oh! Redwoods Part 2, my friends. It looks even more insane and kind of disgusting. Like, the other one was kind of gross, but this is like... It looks like an entire nervous system. However, it also appears to be stuck. So maybe he is nervous. It flies? <laughs> what? How did those manifest as wings? Someone tell me. Okay, anyway, it flies. Um, it... Oh, oh, I didn't think it was that close. Anyway, taking it out, even though it has crazy, crazy health. It falls into what appears to be a white hole, which would push it out and not suck it in. But regardless, it was sucked in and now it is gone. Samj? Oh, it's like the the bear barrels. I still can't say that. But it's fluffier and way more menacing looking. Also, it appears to be almost immune to admin guns because this is not doing diddly squat. What will it take? Do I really even want this thing to be near me? Okay, eventually, after shooting it a million times, it will die. But wow, that is one of the tankiest NPCs we've seen in a while. Squid Game. I am uninstalling Gary's mod, and I will never play it again. Don't get me wrong, I'm not a hater, it's just... It's been overdone to death. It's everywhere. It's not everywhere now, because now it's not relevant. That's how these things go. They're relevant for like a month, and then they disappear, and then now we have this. It appears to have an assault rifle that is... Honestly, looks like it... Wait. What hap... What happened? My game just froze. Anyway. Um... Thank God it's a joke. It's... Pretty bulky, not gonna lie, it's taking a lot of bullets. But eventually, it dies, but the sound doesn't go away. The Betrayal! I feel like I've betrayed you guys from being a troll shill. But regardless, we're gonna mute that because, wow, that's annoying. It appears to be some kind of, um, you know what? How many times have we seen a glob of trolls manifest into a bigger troll? It appears to be even more so a combination of them in unison. And uh, we don't want this thing to touch us, let me tell you. Wow, it's fast too. So let's go ahead and just take it out. And there we go. No transformation, thank God. The bloodier. Finally, a standard looking troll with a knife. Okay, that's new. You know what? It doesn't have that much health, but why is its mouth bleeding? I think we know why. This dude eats people. Let's go ahead and... A cleaver? The knife wasn't good enough? Anyway, now you can see he looks pretty damn pissed. So let's let's take him out of his 
pissed off misery. Wait. Oh. <laughs> what? A phase three. Oh my god, it looks like a centipede from hell. Okay, it's giving me some of those, the, the, what is it, the, the, something woods? Red woods? It's giving me some red woods vibes here. With tons of health. Tons and tons of health. Another phase? Four phases for one troll? Anyway, now it's a floating head with its eyes seemingly exploding and a happy little smiley face in its mouth. Doesn't that just make you want to go near it? Well, not me. So let's go ahead and fine. I'll stop trying to kill you. Just make, just don't make me cry or else. Aw, goodbye for now, I guess. I won't forget this. Wait, what was your name again? Eh, searching. Searching Steam community. Was it player? Yeah, that's it, right? Oh well, bye. What? Huh? As much as I would love to have ended it on that because that just seems like such a fitting NPC to end it on, we have one more before the video comes to a close. And that is of course the festive harvest. Uh, I was gonna make a comment about this, but nah, I'm just not gonna. However, we also notice it doesn't seem to be coming after us. Is this thing passive? Is there such a thing as a truly passive troll? No. This thing's a f***ing liar. And that was the Troll Extreme Pack Part 1. I'm sorry I had to split this up, guys, but I really want to give each of these NPCs their own time. And this video might be too long as it is, but I hope you also enjoyed this crazy addition to the troll family. Linux always coming out with some sick-ass stuff. And I gotta say, these are some pretty cool-looking trolls. A lot of interesting ones so far, like this one, which doesn't even look like a troll or anything like that. And then, of course, we have some of the tried and true classics like the spider, the crazy centipede looking things, and, of course, the giant trolls. But let me know what you guys think down below. Leave a like and subscribe. All the links will be down in the description. My Facebook and Twitter are down there as well. My Discord is also down there. Thanks so much for watching. You guys are sick. Stay sick. Or trolls gonna get you or some shit. I don't know. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. And until next time, farewell.